Hello everyone, welcome to part two of trying to seed my own orchid seeds. In the first video, I showed you how I made the glove box, and in this video, I'll show you how I made the flasking media. The things I needed for this project were some distilled water, a pot to make the mixture in, some glass jars for the flasking later, instructions from the medium, that I bought, I used PT064 from High Media. Little bit of saran wrap to seal the lids. And a pressure cooker for some sterilization. The first thing I did was wash all of the glass jars with a little bit of bleach. From the things that I've read and seen, um, glass seems to be the mes best material to use and they have to be small enough to fit in the pressure cooker. Um, the cleaning of the lids is super important because that's the biggest problem um, with this whole process is the contamination of the flasking media. So um, this part is pretty important. You have to make sure that you uh, clean the lids really well, um, scrub the insides and outsides and just make sure that everything is super clean. I've also heard that people have experimented with different shapes of jars, for example, um, square, and they did the exact same process, but uh, the square jars were contaminated. So I went with the round ones. The powder that I got makes one liter of solution, so the instructions say to take 80% of the water that you're going to use, and I was going to do this in two batches, so I took 400 milliliters of water, measured it out, added it to the pot, and brought it to a boil. After it was boiling, I took the powder that I bought from eBay or Amazon, I can't remember, opened it up, divided it in half, and added it to the pot. After the powder is dissolved in the pot, then you add the last 20% and let it lightly boil for five minutes. After five minutes, you add a little bit to each jar and then uh, fasten the lid. After the lids are set in place, you take the mixture and put it in the pressure cooker. and let it cook at high temperature for 40 minutes. After 40 minutes, take it off the heat and let it cool until you're able to open the lid of the pressure cooker.
and then tighten the tops of the jars and seal them with saran wrap. This isn't the greatest saran wrap job, but I fix it up later and stay tuned for part three where we'll seed the flasks.